Good morning, guys. Let me turn the TV sound down. I'm about to head out of the house. The thing is, I don't know what I want to do today. Everything. I was going to say everything is closed, but that's totally a lie. I just don't know. I'm not motivated to leave the house today, especially because I have a lot of cleaning to do. But I'm going to try to go. I do have a taste for some cookout, but I don't want to go to cookout just yet. And I don't, I don't want to feel like I want to do some shopping. Maybe I'll go apartment hunting. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. So, guys, I decided to drive out to Marietta to this donut place Sky was telling me about. Sky's one of my coworkers and friends. And this is my outfit. And I was thinking, like, it's all a bit too much. But I like the muchness of it all. And I swear when I go out. When I go out uh, side of these doors, I'm not going to feel this way. So I might need to tone it down a bit. I don't know. We'll see. Okay, I've opened it a little bit and I'm feeling this. I, I feel like I am. I'll change the necklace. This gives me an opportunity to wear earrings. I think with this, earrings would be too much though. <sighs> mm. This is what takes me so long to get out of the house. So this is technically outfit number three. You see, I'm trying to keep with the same shirt, right? Right? Oh, I, I will be so upset with myself if I change again. I would be. Okay, I am now leaving my apartment and yes, I changed my outfit again for the fourth time. Um, I kept the shorts though. It wasn't originally true. Anyway, hold up. Um, excuse me. I am headed to Marietta to Donut Monkey, I believe it's called, for donuts. Scott told me about this donut place, and I kind of want to try it. And I also need to get out of the house today. I don't like being in there all day because it just gives me a sense of I'm depressed, and I'm trying not to be that way, you know? Okay, you guys, so I am cutting it hella close. Um, they close at 4 o'clock. It is now 3.08, and my GPS is telling me I'll get there in 40 minutes, so it's at 3.48, which gives me, like, 12 minutes. That's fine. Hopefully, like, parking isn't outrageous and all that stuff because I really want donuts, and for some reason I want donuts from 27 miles away. 27 miles away donuts it is. Let's go to Cummings today. Let's see what Cummings has to offer. <laughs> okay guys, so I made it to Dutch Monkey. I got two donuts and a milk. It's from someplace, a creamery in Delonico, so I gotta shake it out. I'm just saying that to remind myself because I'll pop it open and try to drink it. But, oh my God, if you guys could see like the like bat out of hellness. I made it here within four minutes of closing. <laughs> oh my God, it was outrageous. So the area, I would flip the camera around, but I got things in my other hand. The area is super cute. I'm gonna see what kind of shops are over here. The gas is pretty high, but it's pretty high everywhere. I'm gonna have to get some gas later on. And wishes, thank you. Thank you wishes. <laughs> so I got the Dutch monkey and the Cinnabon and it's about to go down. I am so excited, I can't even, you guys. Okay, so I've already devoured, and this is so gross, I'm so sorry, you guys. I've already devoured the Dutch Monkey donut. It was good, it had peanut butter on the inside and banana, and I love a good peanut butter banana sandwich. And you put that in a donut? In a, what? Okay, whatever. Anyways, <clears throat> I haven't tried this yet. It's the Cinnabon, and my mouth is watering. The milk is really good, too. Whatever that means, I don't know. <laughs> so, I've stopped to get gas, which this is full, supposedly. Does anyone else make it even? I like to try to make it even. I don't know. Like my car can be like, oh, that's enough. And I'm like, ah, let's get to that zero, zero point. 
Anyways, I think I'm gonna go into the gas station, probably get a snack. Those donuts have filled me up and it's not good because it's the only thing I've had to eat today. So, what to do, what to do, what to do. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Oh my God, y'all, look at the teeny thoughts behind me. Oh my God, they are way too young to be a show on as much skin. Listen to me sounding all old and parental. Let them girls do what they want. Um, this area is very suburbia. I'm gonna try to enjoy myself, I guess. Okay, you guys, so I'm in Charming Charlie's right now, right? And I found two keychains that I want. The first one is this. It's really cute, right? This little doggy. Oh. Hanging from my keys, why not? And we're matching. And then the second one is this. Of our current president. I think this is hilarious. It says, I'm huge. This is, I think I want this. And it's only eight bucks. Why not, right? Okay, so I'm leaving Charming Charlie's now. I decided not to get it because if I got it, I would have been a part of the problem. And I didn't always want to feel like explaining how I found it ironic and funny that he had like sparkling glitter hair that, and said I'm huge on the back. Like, that's hilarious. Anyways, I didn't want to always explain that, so I just left it. I'm possibly going over to the Barnes and Nobles. I've never been to Cheeky. That may be where lunch is going to be from. Or Chick-fil-A. Who's to say, you know? Okay, so I'm now leaving this shopping plaza. I went into a few other stores, but I really didn't see anything that wowed me, really. I did buy a charm for the from the store that was going out of sale. Um, it just has a W on it, because my last name begins with a W. And I am very narcissistic that way. Um, right now, I am actually looking for real food. Don't try it, witch. Don't try it. Um, so I'm gonna head over to the other pl plaza to see if they actually have things to eat at an affordable, oh, I don't know. I just want to eat something and I know I don't want none of this crap over here. Okay, so I feel like I've been in the bougiest areas of the suburbs today. This place right here is a place called Nito's. I don't know if the smell is coming from them because the door says they're closed. But it smells amazing around here somewhere. I don't want to eat in a dining restaurant because I'm going to eat by myself and it's pretty sad. But I want to find something to snack on. Okay, there's a store over here called Brit's Clothes. It's pretty prepster. I'm going in. Oh, nope. No, I'm not. They're closed. Never mind. But that's what they have to offer. Okay, it looks like there's like a cute little frozen frozen yogurt spot right behind me here. Um, the kids are out, they're playing in this little Astro Turf area, which is really cute. And then that's Mexican, which I'm not a big fan of Mexican food. There doesn't seem to be a whole lot else to eat. I'm gonna try this Happy Bella kitchen. This is such a cute little area. Okay, so I've picked up my lunch from Happy Belly Kitchen. I should have taken some video and footage while I was in there, but the vibe was so weird. The girl on the inside was super helpful and super kind. Um, I am one of the very few brown people in this area right now. And usually I don't let that bother me until I start getting the what are you doing here looks <laughs> that I'm constantly getting from everyone but the camera helps me bust that down because if i get those looks it's usually because because the camera is up in my face so it's really cool so i've decided to have my lunch in this like super cute and bougie neighborhood look at how beautiful those houses over there are they have a park over here i'm gonna go to the top of that little pavilion up there and eat my lunch it says no trespassing violators pools and tenor courts uh, it's a resident and accompanied vet i can't go in there because i'm not a resident <sighs> okay you guys so i decided to eat here anyway if someone says something to me i'll just leave and i'll take the ticket who cares right but eating my sandwich right this burger 
I got it medium well because I like my burgers medium well. Someone once told me, you're not really appreciating the meat if you don't have it like a little pink. So I started eating it medium well. Very delicious burger. The fries were tasty as well. The cookies are on point. And I could have got this at Kroger for a dollar. I really don't like that lemonade because it needs to be watered down and there's so much bite to it. But uh, I needed something to drink with this and that was portable and this was like one of the few things they had that I wanted. Anyways, delicious meal. Delicious. I would definitely go back there again and get another one. Good. You guys, I've taken off my shoes. <laughs> it is just such a great day out here. I'm gonna have to head back home soon to do some cleaning because I'm hanging out with Monet tomorrow. Woo and uh, <laughs> we're gonna see if we could do something. We may travel outside of the city of Atlanta. I'm driving, so it's most likely a possibility. The air out today is just amazing though. It's like a nice breeze, the sun's out, and these birds, it's like the Mariah Carey and Whitney Houston and Adele of birds live in this neighborhood somewhere. And this is a community where you can drive your golf cart. So I've seen some pretty jazzy golf carts driving through here. It's been kind of funny. Okay, so I've chosen to try these on. This store doesn't have bigger mirrors. That's so weird. Oh, they're so ugly. They're like, I mean, they're a masculine hill, yeah, but like they're so, what would I wear with these? Nothing, cause the heel's so chunky. Oh, look at all the veins in my feet. Okay, so I have no desire of buying these. But after having on those biscuits, I want it to feel, I don't know, powerful, strict, sexy, strong. Let's see if I can get a mirror to show you guys me and these. Hmm, these are definitely a higher heel. The arch is kind of crazy. Let's see if I can pump and snuff through this aisle. Oh, that was weird. Here we go. Uh, I would dent these. They wouldn't be pointed and whatnot. Look where my toes stop. There'll be a forever crease right there. No, ma'am. Well, I, like I said, I had no desire to get them anyway. Was I trying to talk myself into them? I feel like I want a pair of boots and I may find them more so in DSW. Oh, by the way, I'm in uh, Nordstrom Off Rack, I believe it's called, or Nordstrom Rack. And uh, they don't have a real big boot selection, but they do have shoes for the big girls. For the big girls. For the... Let me stop. <laughs> okay, you guys, I'm going into Target right now just cause, and it's like nine o'clock at night, so I'm gonna end the vlog here. I think I've ended a vlog in Target before, but we'll talk tomorrow um, or whenever. See you guys in the next one. Remember, like, comment, subscribe. Bye.